And we're going to begin here this morning. We're getting a closer look at the site in Greece where an American scientist was found dead. Greek police tell CBS News they're conducting DNA tests on several people in connection with the murder of Suzanne Eaton. Holly Williams is in Crete where Eaton was attending a conference. Holly, what more have we learned? Good morning. The place where Suzanne Eaton's killer or killers attempted to hide her body is just through this olive grove. But the Greek police still will not confirm whether they have any official suspects. It's a macabre place, the dank Nazi bunker from World War II, where they discovered Suzanne wow. Eaton's body. Look how far that goes down there. Greek police told CBS News the American biologist was suffocated to death. Well, this place can only be described as a kind of uh, underground maze, a complex of tunnels, a labyrinth, if you will. And local officials have told us that they believe that Suzanne Eaton was killed elsewhere and then her body was placed or, or dumped inside this complex of bunkers. The forensic pathologist who carried out the post-mortem told us her death was far from quick. There are reports in the Greek media that she had knife wounds, she may have been tortured. Can you comment on that? No, I will not comment on that right now. Had she been sexually assaulted? I can't comment right now. We're looking forward. You know, maybe we can find DNA. Suzanne Eaton was an extraordinary individual by any measure, an award-winning scientist, keen sportswoman, accomplished pianist and mother of two. Sue is too great a person for her legacy to be defined in any way by how we lost her, her sister said in a statement, a strong, kind, brilliant, selfless human being. When she disappeared Tuesday last week, her family offered a reward for help in finding her. Yes, now Katerina like Kakala-Zorpa yeah. is helping yeah. care for her sons and yeah, husband sons is... at the academy where Suzanne was attending a conference. We saw that family coming and being very much touched by this, but also having all the strength to go until the end to find their mother. Crete is a peaceful place. It is steeped in ancient Greek mythology, and the locals here are horrified by this killing of a guest on their island. Anthony. Holly Williams in Crete, thank you. Yeah, an extraordinary woman and a real mystery here.